panel today, we're going to be focusing on chicken stew. All right? We need two cups of water. I went ahead and got the water bowling because it'll take a few, just a few minutes. We'll be using one chicken bouillon cube, three onions, five baked potatoes. Now these are kind of small, so I went ahead and used five. A pressure cooker, and then we're gonna need four pieces of chicken. And last but not least, we're gonna need some seasoning salt. All right guys, let's get started. All right, we're gonna go ahead and put the chicken bouillon into the water, make some chicken broth. I'll show you what these things look like when you open them up. See that little square right there? We're going to make some chicken broth out of that little square right there. All right. Dump that in there. Now, you do have to keep it stirred up a little bit. All right. That way the hot water will break down that bouillon cube. We can make a chicken broth. That's doing this thing. We're gonna move over to the baked potatoes. A couple of ways you can peel the baked potatoes. You can use the potato cutter. You can go ahead and use this. Like this right here. But since these are so small, I wanna go ahead and use my knife. go and you want to coarse chop these so that means no particular cut is really needed but just remember they need to be really bite sized all right so we're going to put these over here let's go ahead and cut these Get a little bit on there and just got to take off. Down the middle. All right, got our potatoes peeled. Now we're going to work on some onions. Let's turn this down to real low. You want to kind of slice off the ends. Basically, what it is, you want to take off 10%. Of the onions. Kill that outer layer right there. We're just trying to keep as much of the onion as we possibly can. Just want to take out that kind of a green right there. All right, cutting these. We're going to cut them this way straight across and then we're going to cut them like a plus sign all right so this is going to be a core shot so what you want to do is take these and you want to break them down to the little sizes like this right here okay and move this over here so i'll be able to see what i'm doing so one thing i do is Peeling these onions from the inside out, make them just like this right here. And put them in the pan right here, save them for later. All right. Once again, start from the inside. Come apart. Woo, man, I don't need to get any eyes, man. Woo.
All right. One more to go. Oh. Good Lord. That was strong this morning. Definitely gonna have to wash everything, get this onion oh, off of it. All right, it's about time we get done with this. This is what you should have baked potatoes here, or potatoes, and then we should have onions here. All right, man, those onions are strong. Look over there, they're laying around. Lord, wow, got a pressure cooker here. Go ahead and put in four pieces of chicken. Those are frozen. And put in our two cups. Chicken stock here. Go ahead and drop that in there. Potatoes and onions. All in there. Try not to tip. Too much, because it will all come tumbling down. All right, we got potatoes and onions in there. We have to do season salt now. We're gonna do two tablespoons. Season salt. Now you want to move around like this right here. You don't put it in one spot. Just two tablespoons. Put it a little bit more even. Alright. It's kind of plugged up. We'll get this party started. I mean, this is ready to go. Top on, make sure it's secure, and we're going to put it on the low temp cook. Boom. Work. There we go. For about six hours, it's going to be ready because I want to do the slow cooking on this right here. All right, guys, we're going to come back just here in a little while and we're going to see how it turns out. Right, guys, see you in just a few. All right, guys, our chicken stew is done. Let's open this bad boy up and see what we got. Yeah, we're in a minute. Oh, look at that. Woo, look at here. Look at that. Mm-hmm. That is some chicken stew right there. go some chicken stew just a few little things in there some spice some baked potatoes some onions and some chicken we're good to go all right guys we got our chicken soup in a bowl look at this right here that look good all right uh all right guys thank you for uh coming to the mint melon don't forget to like subscribe and share and as always, have a great day.